Okay, Kittle just dropped a major update, and if you're a print-on-demand seller, this will save you a ton of time and can help you make more sales. Kittle has switched to Google's Nano Banana as the default in Kittle Flows. Here we can see that it's 10 times faster, cheaper to use, and keeps your logos, graphics, and text exactly as you design them. If you've used AI design tools for design creation, mockups, or edits, you know how frustrating they can be. Your designs can get changed or distorted, simple edits can take forever, and character mockups or design graphics look different each time. Nano Banano fixes that, allowing you to create realistic mockups with consistent characters, edit images with a simple prompt, and make consistent design variations. Now that you're more familiar with the benefits of this new update, let me show you how to actually use it for design creation, mock-up creation, and image editing to make more sales and grow your brand. Also, be sure to watch until the end for a special bonus tip, where I'll show you another super cool feature to create realistic lifestyle mock-ups for unique print-on-demand products that don't have mock-ups. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Adrian, a self-employed entrepreneur who's generating multiple millions in revenue across two apparel brands, and I help people make money online with Shopify and print on demand. My goal is to create the most positive and supportive community of print on demand sellers here on YouTube. So if that's you, join us by subscribing and interacting in the comments. Okay, let's start by creating a trendy t-shirt design. I hopped into Kittle and selected templates, t-shirts, and searched the word tennis to find a design template to work from. I chose this template here to create a design for the tennis niche. And I'm not gonna make too many changes to this, but I do wanna change it enough to make it original. Let's go ahead and update this year. I'll change New York to Newport. And then let's just slightly modify this. Now I could start using Nana Banana to create variations of this design, but I'm really happy with it, so we'll leave that as is. Now that we have our design ready to go, step two, let's use Nana Banana to create a lifestyle photo shoot of a woman wearing this design. All you need to do is select the artboard, tap add a smart board, and then input your prompt. Notice that Nano Banana is already set as the default. And look how much quicker it is than ChatGPT and the other options. It's by far the fastest, only taking 15 seconds to generate an image. Also, it's free right now at the time that I'm recording this, but it usually only costs 10 tokens, making it cheaper than both of the ChatGPT options. Before, I was using ChatGPT Image 1 HD, which takes 42 tokens. Let's go ahead and input a prompt. I just said, put this on a mock-up of a realistic white Bella and Canvas 3001 t-shirt with a close-up of an athletic woman wearing the t-shirt facing forward, standing on a tennis court. I'll tap generate and check that out. In about 15 seconds, it generated this incredible lifestyle mock-up. Now let's say we want a top angle shot of her. Just tap the mock-up, add smart board, and input the prompt. I just put, have the woman sitting on the tennis court, capture a top angle close-up shot from the chest upwards, emphasizing the design. I'll tap generate. How good does this mock-up look? The design details look perfect and it created a consistent character for me like I wanted. Imagine trying to find high quality photo shoot style mockups like this of a woman playing tennis online. It would be difficult and time consuming to find mockups this specific even if they existed. But in less than a minute, I was able to generate these super relevant mockups that I can use on my website or for marketing on social media, email or ads. Let's create one more mockup of her playing tennis. I'll select this top angle shot, tap smart board, and then input a prompt. I just said create a full body shot of this woman wearing the same clothes, playing tennis, and prominently feature the design. Check that out. The character, the design, and the background are all consistent. Now let's say we want to create these exact mockups, but for a black t-shirt. I'll select the first mockup, add smart board, and input a prompt. I just said make her t-shirt color black. And just like that, in seconds, it changed the shirt color without changing anything else. The level of consistency here is crazy. And we could go ahead and do the exact same thing for all these mock-ups. So let's select the second one, add smart board, input the exact same prompt, and then let's do it for the third. Select the third image, smart board, input prompt, and now we have lifestyle mockups in both the color white and black. Seriously, how cool is that? Before you'd have to use advanced editing software like Photoshop to make edits like these. Now you can do it all in one place in seconds. From here, you can make further edits, but I'm actually really happy with these. Now let's say you wanna download these images to use for your website and marketing. If you wanna download any one of these images, you can just select an image, 
and tap the quick export icon. And if you wanna download all of these images, you can just tap the export button in the top right. From here, you would just leave it at all artboards, select the file type that you want and tap download. But notice when I click on the images, you can see here that they're 960 by 1235 pixels. This size is totally fine for social media posts, but I'll want higher resolution images for my website. To increase the size resolution, I'll just need to upscale them, which I can do from here. So let's say I wanna upscale this image. First, I'll tap convert to image, and then I'm just gonna select this upscale icon. Here we can see that one image has been upscaled. Now what I can do on the right hand side under transform, I can change the dimensions. For example, let's change the width of this image to 2048, which is Shopify's recommended width size for product images. I went ahead and upscaled all three lifestyle mockups so that I can use those for website images. And then lastly, I just wanna increase this design file size. So I'll just tap the artboard input the dimensions that I want. And as you can see here, the artboard is much bigger than the design. So for this particular design that I use from a template, I'm just gonna stretch it so that it better fits the artboard. And now I have everything that I need to upload this to Printify. By the way, you can try Kittle for free by clicking the link below. And if you wanna upgrade your subscription to the pro plan, which is what I use, make sure you use code ADRIANYT for 25% off. I've included links below for all of my favorite print on demand tools, along with any free trials, discounts, or special offers. Thank you in advance for using any of those links. Sponsors and affiliates support this channel at no extra cost to you and allow me to create more free content like this, which I hope you're finding super valuable. So to recap, step one, I created a t-shirt design from a Kittle design template. Step two, I created lifestyle mockups and edited them exactly how I wanted them. And now for step three, I want to add the design and mockups to a trendy t-shirt so I can start marketing and selling it online. To do that, I'm gonna use Printify. This is one of my favorite POD companies because it has over a thousand products to sell, low production costs, and production partners all around the world. You can use Printify for free by clicking the link below and get 30 days of free premium membership with code ADRIAN30, which gives you a discount of up to 20% on most products in Printify's catalog. Within Printify, I'll just select catalog and under women's clothing, t-shirts. Here you'll have a ton of options to choose from, but I'm just gonna go ahead and select this Bell and Canvas 3001D. From the editor, you can change the color options by tapping this edit tools icon and select variants. For this example, I'm just gonna keep it really simple and sell it on a white t-shirt like the lifestyle mockups that I created. Next, I'll just drag the design onto the mockup. From here, you can adjust the sizing and the placement, and I wanna make it match the mockups that I created. I'm gonna tap preview to get a more realistic image of the shirt. I can also tap show more to see what it looks like on a model to make sure that the design sizing and placement matches up with my mockups. I'm happy with how this looks, so I'm just gonna tap save product. From the mockup library, you can see all the different mockups provided by Printify. You could use Placeit if you have a Placeit account, or you can upload your own, which is what I'm gonna do. Here you can see that I uploaded the lifestyle mockups created in Kittle which in my opinion are much nicer than the default lifestyle mockups in Printify. Not to mention they enhance the brand and are more likely to catch the attention of tennis lovers. You can go ahead and add any other mockups that you want here. Now that I've uploaded all of my mockups, I'll fill out the listing details and have Printify publish this to my Shopify store. And now for the bonus tip. One thing I like about Printify is that they're always releasing new products that I don't see other print on demand companies offering. You can find these early access products by going to the catalog and then searching early access. The only problem is that many of these early access products don't have mockups, meaning you have to download product images from Printify and create your own. For example, let's go with this unisex jersey muscle tank. Here we can see that there's no preview or pre-made mockups with your design in this product. This has been a problem for a long time, but now you can quickly and easily create attractive high quality mockups with Kittle's Nano Banana integration. Let me show you how. Step one, back in Kittle, I'm just gonna go ahead and create another artboard. Step two, I'll drag one of the images provided by Printify onto this artboard. Step three, I'm gonna duplicate the design and then overlay this design onto the mockup. So I'll just go ahead, I'll adjust the sizing and the placement to make it look more realistic. And step four, I'll just select this artboard, add smart board, and tell it what I want in the image. So I just said, create a lifestyle mockup featuring this image standing on a realistic tennis court. I'll tap generate. 
and check that out. Just like that, we have this realistic lifestyle mock-up that looks just like the tank top and the model. Notice it even has the same nail color and the tattoos. From here, I can continue making changes to this woman and the background, but I just wanted to show you how powerful this update is at maintaining consistency. We are living in the golden age of design and image creation. It's never been faster or easier to design, edit, or create high quality realistic mockups for print on demand products. Like every AI design tool, Nana Banana is not perfect, but this is the best I've ever seen. And I expect it to only continue getting better. If you wanna see more ways that this new Kittle integration can help you save time and help you make more sales, comment Nano below so I know to create more videos like this. Also, I've created a bunch of free resources, which you can find below, including my free 60 minute on-demand training, where I reveal the exact sales and marketing strategy that I used to generate multiple millions in revenue across two apparel brands with Shopify and print on demand.